How to measure I square C, the circuit board is now powered on. The main control chip on the board and this chip are communicating via the I square C protocol. For easier measurement, three DuPont wires are used to lead out the three I square C pins. After connecting the wires, take out the oscilloscope probe, set the oscilloscope probe to 10x attenuation to minimize interference with the original circuit. The ground clip of the oscilloscope probe should be connected to the ground DuPont wire of the board to ensure the same ground potential and prevent signal interference. Meanwhile, the IC clock CCL and data style lines are connected separately using probes. At this point, the oscilloscope is successfully capturing the two I square C signals. We first set channel 1 to 10x attenuation. Then, enable channel 2 and also set it to 10x attenuation. Now we can see the waveform flickering on the screen. Next, change the trigger mode to single. To capture the waveform. Alternatively, you can set the trigger mode to normal. Then, start the oscilloscope. You'll notice that when we move the signal, the waveform updates in real time. This is how I2C signal capturing works. So, have you learned it?